Richard, I would imagine a majority of your students here are in the class, in the program, because they want to be professional screenwriters. They want to make their living as such. What's the likelihood that any of them will do this? Grim, first of all, uh, among the writers who come into our program who want to be successful, a, a majority of them is 100% a majority. I mean, every one of them wants to be a successful professional, and that's what we want them to be. We are a professional school, and our great uh, uh, success is their success. Um, they're doing fabulously well uh, in, in all media now. Uh, indeed, on the, I mentioned that I was in a flight to Portland. I went with the family to Hawaii, and we also went to New York. Uh, so that's four flights, you know, two round trips. On each one, there was a movie written by a student, uh, a f an alumnus from the program, and several television episodes. You know how they run out of them. They finish the movie and there's still time, so they run some TV uh, episodes of old series and so on. And they're all, they're all, in, all my commandos who were sitting in the classes just a few years ago, and that is gratifying. They all want to be, be professionals. That's what we uh, want them to be. Uh, so what is the question? Why? What's the likelihood? Oh, what's the likelihood? I was saying um, uh, you have to assume it's not going to work out. Um, God is watching. If if she sees you take it for granted that uh, it's going to work out, then it's not going to it's not going to work out. Um, if you need certainty, uh, you shouldn't even start this. If you need to know for sure that you'll succeed at it, you just have to get into the stream and hope for the best. Uh, and at the at the end of the day, let everybody uh, else betray you and and shortchange you and let you down. But at least you be true to yourself and keep the writing coming. You got you got to crank the stuff out. You have to keep the stuff coming. That's the most important the most important part of it. Um, yeah, I mean, listen. What is a writer trying to do? She's trying to literally trade her daydreams for dollars. Writer, you know, she's trafficking in her own imagination. Uh, 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 you know, writers get scolded for what other, I'm sorry, other people get scolded for writers, for what writers get praised for, and that is daydreaming. Um, uh, what could be better than that, you know, to literally uh, live by your wits? Uh, so a lot of people are going to compete for it, and it's going to be difficult to uh, succeed at that. But at the end of uh, your life, let everybody else have let you down. But at least you be a warrior for your for yourself. We do rejoice in an embarrassment of riches here. We do see our students, for the most part, succeed and have uh, successful professional lives. But um, I like to think that they don't really expect that. They certainly don't take it for granted that that will come to pass. If they do, they will they will not succeed.